Increase your Tagalog vocabulary in the short Tagalog lesson. Umaga, you've previously learned this word. It means morning, right? Umagahan is breakfast. Second word, tanghali is noon. Tanghalian is lunch. Anong oras ka magtatanghalian? What time will you be having your lunch? Tanghali na! Alas dose na! Alas dose na ng tanghali. It's already 12 noon. Tara na! Magtanghalian na tayo. Come on, let's eat lunch. Hapon in English is afternoon. Hapunan is dinner. So again guys, umaga, morning. Umagahan, breakfast. Tanghali, noon. Tanghalian, lunch. Hapon, afternoon. Hapunan, dinner. Kain, this is the root word for the verb eat, right? Pagkain is food. Inom is drink. Inumin is drinks. Ano ang pagkain mo? What's your food? Ano ang inumin mo? What's your drinks? Ano ang umagahan mo? What's your breakfast? Ano ang panghalian mo? What's your lunch? Ano ang hapunan mo? What's your dinner? Ang umagahan ko ngayon ay salad. Ito ang almusal ko araw-araw. Ito ang umagahan ko araw-araw. Ito ang pagkain ko araw-araw. This is my food every day. This is my breakfast every day. Chaa, tea. Umiinom ako ng chaa araw-araw. I drink tea every day. So in a casual, everyday conversation, the more common term that we use for breakfast is almusal, which is derived from Spanish term almuerzo, lunch in Espanol. So we say almusal or umagahan. Umagahan is kind of formal. Almusal is casual. But in songs, you can hear the term umagahan. Just like in the song lyrics, Ang aking hapunan ay iyong umagahan. Let's say you live in the U.S. and, I, and I'm here in the Philippines. Ang aking hapunan ay iyong umagahan. My dinner is your breakfast. <laughs> Kanta yan guys eh, that's a song. Ang aking hapunan ay iyong umagahan. At kahit na anong mangyari, balang araw ay makakapiling ka. It's a love song about long distance relationship. All right, guys, there you have it. Tagalog listening practice nine. Just a short lesson to increase your vocabs. This is Dara from Twitter of Manila. Follow me for more.